we are going to do an experiment right now into precognition. And that means being able to see into the future, to know what's going to happen before it does. You will notice over my right shoulder, there is a playing card inside of an envelope. And I placed that playing card there. Earlier today, you all saw that envelope and have seen it since about one o'clock this afternoon. We're all in different locations, so we're in four different locations. Natalie has so kindly borrowed a deck of playing cards from her family and now sight unseen to us because I will not see the playing cards. I'm going to ask you, Natalie, just to shuffle up the cards, mix them up as much as you want to. And once you feel they are completely randomized, completely mixed up, then I want you, if you will, to just say, I've mixed them thoroughly. Okay. Not a great shuffler game. That's all right. <laughs> don't, don't have to be at all. Just the, the idea is just to randomize the cards. So there'd be no way I would know their order. And then with them still face down, if you're ready, I'm going to have you please count eight cards from the deck. We will use those eight cards and we'll put the rest of the deck aside. We're not going to use the other cards. Now, what I'm going to ask you to do is in a moment, I'll have you mix those eight cards. I'm going to have you randomize them. So again, we have no idea which eight cards you selected and we have no idea those eight, uh, the order of those eight cards. Once you've mixed them up and you're comfortable with that, then I just want you to pick up the top card on that packet of eight cards, look at it, don't show it to us, remember it, set it right back on top, okay? And now I will ask, I'm gonna ask for a number from one to 10. And should I ask, um, Leah, what number would you like from one to 10? About three. Three, what I'm gonna have you do Natalie, I want you to pick up the cards, put them into your hand without looking at them. And I want you to take the top card, put it to the bottom of the pack. That's one. I want you to take the next card, put it to the bottom of the pack. That's two. And I'll have you take the next card, put it to the bottom of the pack. That's three. And now to randomize them even more, I'm going to have you do that again. One, two, three. Then. Once that's done, then what I want you to do, please, is in a moment, I'm going to have you deal out two rows of cards, um, two horizontal rows. So I'll have you deal out one, two, three, four. That'll be the top row. And then five, six, seven, eight is the bottom row. And you can deal them all face down. So we still, no one has any idea. If someone were standing there looking over your shoulder, they would have no idea what cards are there and they would have no idea what order they're in. Now, you may turn them face up in place. Where they are, just turn them face up. And so now you see all the cards. Of course, you see your card too. So what I want you to do is to silently look at the cards. And as you're looking at the cards, the top row, the fourth card in that row, I want you just to, don't show it to us, but just lightly pick it up from the table. Natalie, that's not your card. You can discard that card, okay? Okay. Now I want you to go to the bottom row and pick up the fourth card in that row and just look at it. Natalie, that's not your card either, so you can discard that card. Now, what I want you to do is to look at the top row, the bottom row. I want you to look at your card. And in a moment, what I'm going to have you do is just, I'm going to have you pick up your card and then either trade places with it with the card to the left of it or trade places with it with the card to the right of it. And once you've done that, just say, I'm done. Very good. 
So we've mixed the cards up even more. Now what I'm going to ask you to do is just out loud, starting with the first card, just announce row one out loud to Monica Lee and myself. Just have you call out the top row. Okay. Four of diamonds, king of diamonds, queen of diamonds. Very good. And now what I'm going to ask you to do is I want you to call out for us out loud the bottom row. Ah, oh, shoot. I don't remember the name of That's okay. That's okay. <laughs> clover. <laughs> okay. You can say you can say clover. That's fine. Okay. Two of clovers, three of clovers, two of hearts. Very good. Now, when you say clovers, there is what's known as spades and clubs. Mm -hmm. and yeah, it's a spade. It's a spade. Okay, very good. And that's fine. Now, what I want you to do is I want you to look at those cards. And what I want you to do is I want you not to tell me what your card is, but I want you to pick up your card. Don't show it to us. Just pick it up and hold it in your hand. Okay. Is that your card's not in the top row, is it? It is. <laughs> I thought it was because you'll notice we have the envelope here. And the envelope has been sitting here all this time with this card exposed. And what I'm going to do is we are going to remove from here the clip. We will open up the envelope and I'm going to ask you to see it here. I want everything to stay in the field as I remove the card from the envelope. I want you with your back, I don't want to see the face yet. I want you please to show us the card. You're holding it with the back to us so we can't see the face. Very good. Now I'm going to ask you please to tell us what your card is and to turn it around. Okay, King of Diamonds. Your card is the King of Diamonds. And in fact, the card in the envelope oh. won this afternoon. <laughs> That's so good. <laughs> Thank you. Thank you. Oh. Thank you.